It's early morning and Julia, Michael and Liz are about to face their next challenge. Working a busy lunchtime service at the Larder, a modern British restaurant based at the Hilton Hotel on the banks of the Thames. Head chef Jonathan McCann is looking for high standards from the celebrities. We expect you to work alongside us, work the same as us and produce the same kind of food that we do here. I want it to be all about you today. If you produce something I'm not happy with, you will get it back and have to do it again. It's 12 o'clock and the restaurant is filling up. OK, guys, service is starting on order for duck liver. Yes, chef. Michael is responsible for the starter of sautéed duck livers with wild mushrooms in Armagnac, served on a toasted brioche. But there's no room for mistakes in the professional kitchen. Michael, you really need to work on your plates. Right away, three pork. Yes, chef. Liz is cooking pork escalope with quail's eggs and pork jus. Relax, turn it over, look. There you go. Nice, nice cooking technique. It's just plating up. Yeah. And you're getting a little bit nervous and tense. But listen, you're doing a good job overall. Okay. Still shaking. And that's, that's, that's what's wrong with my presentation, because when I do the jus, to be honest, I think I make quite a mess of it. Julia is in charge of grilled sardines with tomato, garlic and mixed herbs. I don't order two sardines. Yes, yeah. chef. Excuse me. As her first order comes in, she sets off at breakneck speed. Mm. Plate, please. Sardine plate, please. No, 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 no. Wait, wait, just wait now. Wait. Okay. I will call it away. Just have it, hold okay. it, and I'll call it away. Julia's sardines are ready too soon. It's all about timing. It's, he calls the order, then you've got to remember it, and then it's not until he calls you to cook it that you have to get going again. So it's a bit... Some starts perfect for me. It's quite erratic and full of energy. It's an hour into service, and there's no time for a rest. OK, we need to step it up a bit now, guys. We're starting to get busier. Michael, three duck liver. Three and then two, yes, yeah? Yes, please. Yep. First time I've had Armagnac in the eyeball. Duck liver, thank you, Michael. Much better, thank you. Thanks, Chef. You do the same dish over and over and you suddenly get into the rhythm of it. You know what I mean? So you feel a reasonable degree of confidence. With his technique perfected, Michael continues to produce excellent starters. But the orders are mounting up for Liz and Julia. I'm waiting for one pork, one sardine. Yes, chef. Yes, chef. Ooh! Ah! Ow! I need more. What do I need? That's table number four, yeah. Excuse me. Right, come on, let's go, let's go, let's go. Liz has managed to produce her dish on time. Are they on? Yeah, they're good. Yeah. Come back. Well done, well done. But Julia's mistakes are holding up service. Julia, please, people Come, are chef. waiting. Coming. I need that sardine, please, now. Sorry, chef. My fault. I want it. My sardine, chef. Fantastic, well done. Yep. Good. <laughs> Service is finally over. All right, love. But how did they do? Tell me about Julia. She was all over the place with it. But she has that energy that a, a cook needs to get through a busy service. How about Michael? He can get everything together to get onto the plate. As soon as it goes to the plate, he loses all coordination. But by the end of the, the service, he got it right. Tell me about Liz. She was so afraid. And, 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 but she was so good. The thing I liked about Liz, she really cared about what she gave me. When she brought the plate up, she had heart in it. Jonathan, who was the best cook? Liz. Out of the three of them, Liz is the one that has the, the natural flair.